students today we are going to study about direct and indirect speech which are been known as narration narration means to narrate something so today we are going to start this lecture and uh, first of all we are going to study about the change of tense when we are making sentence of direct sentence into indirect <clears throat> so let's see when the sentence is in the present indefinite we use present indefinite direct sentence and change this sentence into past indefinite as same as present continuous must be changed into past continuous present perfect into past perfect present perfect continuous into past perfect continuous past indefinite into past perfect past perfect sorry past continuous into past perfect continuous past perfect no change and past perfect continuous will always remain same the sentence where there is will we always use would instead of will so this is the tense changing in the direct and indirect speech let's see that how we can change the sentence of direct speech into indirect so let's see if i write a sentence e sat i broke the chair in this sentence you can see the tense which we have written is in the past indefinite direct speech is in the past indefinite one thing always use full stop after the inverted commas sometime it happen that we write the full stop and we put the inverted commas or it's wrong always put the inverted commas before the full stop it's very very important so i broke the glass this is the past indefinite this is the sentence which is actually narrated by the speaker of the sentence or we can say that this these are the actual words of the speaker now we have to change these actual words of a speaker into indirect speech now see this sentence or this clause he said will remain same but instead of comma we use that t h a t that instead of comma to join the sentences he said i broke the glass now it will be changed into he said he now guys let's see he said will remain same because it is the positive sentence fine he said that to join the two statements he we have changed only the pronoun over here now you can see that this is the sentence of past indefinite and now we have to change the sentence into past perfect so the sentence will be he said that he had now the form of verb will be changed he had broken the chair and you have to remove the inverted commas and there must be only full stop in the end so guys this is the formation of indirect sentence and this is we have changed direct sentence into indirect now you can see you just need as i have told you before 
that helping verb tells about the tense and main verb tells about the sentence. So in this way you can also make the more sentences and you can also practice it. Write down over here, he has broken, so it must be changed into he had broken as I have written over here. So in this way you can learn easily and if you want to ask any question, you can practice more, make sentences and you can easily learn the change of direct speech into indirect. Thank you very much.